Good morning. It's no, it hasn't. It's very grey. How are you doing? Listen, I'm staying with family at the minute, so I've got to talk a little bit quiet. It's very early in the morning. Oh, you all right? I'm tired. I'm going back to Spain today. I wasn't sure if I'd do a morning briefing because there's nothing to say really. But I thought I would because I'm nice like that. Have I got any shout outs to do? Um, oh, by the way, I've also got a throat infection. Um, I think there was one shout out. Uh, let's have a look. Daryl Kenshington. Get some lem sip or something for that throat. Get well soon. Uh, thank you, Daryl. And also, Clark Andy. Thanks for putting others first. So, Daryl and Clark Andy. I guess he's Andy Clark. Cheers, fellas. Uh, they use the super thanks thing. I haven't done any live streams for a few days. So, um, what are the other ones called? Super chats. There's none of them. There'll be no live streams today. Um, but there will be tomorrow, two o'clock, tomorrow afternoon is my first one. Um, all being well, providing I get back to Spain, okay. <clears throat> two o'clock tomorrow afternoon, and I think we'll do one at six o'clock tomorrow night. Two and six UK time, all right? But if it's dead, if it's quiet, if no one comes along, I'm just gonna watch TV in the evening. I'm sick of hearing about Trent Alexander-Arnold and that fucking contract now, are you? <clears throat> I saw some on social media this morning and it said <laughs> What did it say? I'll find it Real Madrid is seriously interested in Alexander-Arnold as they look for a long-term solution at right-back. The interest from the Spanish giants could influence his decision, especially giving his emphasis on competing for and winning major trophies. Oh, it's funny how they're saying that now, isn't it, after his comments the other day. This is coming from someone called Ekrim Kono. <laughs> you see him? Would you trust that guy? <laughs> uh, <clears throat> caught offside ESPN and Goal a global transfer news expert and he's also an email address for collaboration you know what I'm saying Gmail <clears throat> I'm sure he's a nice fella I'm not taking piss out of him I'm just saying that I think journalists in general just chat shit. Do you know what I mean? Collaboration. You know what collaboration means, don't you? <clears throat> A global transfer fucking expert. I'm an expert at making cups of tea. So I got a train back from York yesterday with my girlfriend. And we got on the train with these. Right, so she's carrying these. And people like going, oh, you know, looking at us both and that. And this old man sat on the table next to us, went, oh, they're lovely. You know how to look after a woman. I thought, how does he know that? No, but then I saw the flowers, right? And I went, oh, she bought myself. I didn't buy, I didn't buy the fucking flowers. The only flower I buy is for Yorkshire puddings. No, she bought them for my cousin. This is my, oh, you are my cousins. And my girlfriend stayed here the other night. So she was just saying thank you. You know what women are like, aren't you? Ooh, let's get some flowers. Fellas are glad, you want a beer? 
actually fellas won't fucking say anything, would they? Ugh. Tetley tea bags. Tetley. Not Yorkshire tea biscuit brew. Oh, Yorkshire tea biscuit brew caramel. Oh, I'm going home. I can't wait to get home. <coughs> fucking hell, I sound like Barry White, don't I? So, <clears throat> I'm going to have this cup of tea and then I'm off. Well, I've got some chores to do. So, oh, my nana used to say, I used to go, where are you going, nana? Just going on some errands. Did you ever get told that as a kid? An errand. Going on an errand. What it means is, mind your fucking business. That's what it means. So, <clears throat> yeah, I'm going on an errand. No, I'm very open with you guys. I'll tell you what I'm doing. I'm off to uh, the bank. Well, not the bank, the post office. So I got some birthday money off me hand here now, so I can't take Sterling back. So I'm going to put that in the bank. Because um, she's trying to encourage me to go and see my boy Smooth, you know, uh, in November. You know, my best friend, he lives in America. His mum died recently, you know, and he came to me when my mum died. And it's only right I go to him, it's, you know, but I want to go and see him. So they give me a birthday, some birthday money, like go and get yourself over, go and see your friend kind of thing. So I need to go and put that in the bank. Uh, not the bank, the post office. Same thing. Right, anyway. And then I'm going to get some grub for my little box. I don't know where it is. I've got a little plastic box that I put in my hand luggage so I can have something to eat on plane. I'm not paying their prices. Oh, fuck that. Um, <clears throat> I'm from Yorkshire, remember. And then I'm going to go and see my mum up at the cemetery see what she's got to say. She doesn't really say anything, to be honest with you. <clears throat> and then I'm off for my train. Well, I need to say goodbye to my auntie. Then I'm off for my train. It's always sad when the train pulls out of, you know, town. Do you know what I mean? Because you're leaving everyone behind. Uh, and I met my way to the airport for my flight this afternoon, and hopefully everything will be all right. It's pissing down at the moment, so it might be a bit bumpy. My eyes are a bit ready, isn't it? But the good thing is that I'm going home to my own bed to be rescued dog, Remy. I always had the rescued dog because then the girls go, oh, do you know that? come on, get them. I'm not stupid. Right? <clears throat> and uh, you guys, because when I go home, I'll be doing all my vids again, well, on my live streams. Tomorrow, live stream, two o'clock and six o'clock. You better be there. I'm keeping an eye on who's turning up. I am. If you're at work in the afternoon, then fine. If I don't get an hello from you, even on this video, it'll be trouble. I, I, I know who's loyal with me. I do. In fact, during the next transfer window, we might go members only and, and, and shut out them all them people out that only come and see us when there's transfer news. What do you reckon, guys? Should we get rid of them? Do you know what I'm having for breakfast? Do you want to know? I'll show you. <clears throat> now there's a lot of carbohydrates in here. I shouldn't look at my eyes, really so. There's a lot of carbs in here. Fucking hell. 65 grams of carbs. In 100 grams. That's all sugar. That's insane. Well, carbs, sugar, glucose, you know what I mean? Fuck. I'm not telling you why I've brought some bran. <clears throat> I just need a bit of assistance at the moment. There'll be a couple of people watching, I don't know why, you're full of shit. Well, exactly, that's the whole point that. Right, I'm off. They've got nothing to say. Thanks for those of you that commented my video last night and sent best wishes to William. All right, if you don't know about William, you need to watch my last video, my debriefing last night. I did email uh, Neil, his brother-in-law, yesterday, but I hadn't heard back yesterday. I don't like it when that happens, to be honest with you. So hopefully he'll touch base today. 
Um, so yeah, I'm going home. Thanks for allowing me um, a little break. Um, I've had a lovely time in England with my family, friends, chick, everyone that I love, uh, really. So, like I say, I've got a couple of things to do this morning. Go and see my mum. My mum's the last thing I do, do you know what I mean? Like, cause then it's off straight to the train station. It's part of my ritual. Um, don't know why, but it's the last thing I do. And uh, and then I go. I'm looking forward to going home, to be honest with you. And I was tempted to stay another week um, to be with my chick, really. Uh, but I need to get back and uh, back to my responsibilities. And I have a lot of things that I need to do, including net. United TV, that's coming when I get back home. Um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm, I'm sure a recommended video comes up at the end, I'm not sure. But I've got a lot of things to do. <clears throat> this Saturday, I think we're doing Saturday night steaming, streaming, streaming. Um, we'll see, because I don't know when the football, my local football team play, and if that's on Sunday, I wanna be fresh. So we'll see, we'll work it out. All right, guys, listen, uh, if there's anything to do with Liverpool um, that you've seen overnight, please do drop me a comment. Um, let me know how you are. Did you have a good weekend? What's the weather like where you are? It's raining here. It's absolutely pissing now. Um, and hopefully the next time you see my chubby cheeks uh, will be in España. Mm -hmm. uh, tomorrow afternoon, two o'clock. Well, maybe some videos in the morning. I do feel like I've got a few things I want to talk to you about, um, but I want to be in my own environment for that, really. Pissing down. Hmm. All right, guys. Thanks for uh, thanks for watching. Uh, if you appreciate the video, please thumbs up the video. It will give you lots of luck today, I promise you. It will. If you don't thumbs up the video, it's going to be fucking hell on today for you. Hell on. Absolute hell, there'll be kittens getting drowned all over the world, all because you didn't thumbs up my video. And if you thumbs down, you're dicing with death, you're jinxing yourself because it's karma. Do you know what I'm saying? Oh, just got a text message, nothing excited, just my mobile, not my mobile, no, my internet service provider back in Spain telling me my phone bill's due. That's very kind of them to let me know, isn't it? I'm sure they won't fucking forget. Yeah, thumbs up the video if you appreciate my video channel or whatever the fuck you want to, I don't know, whatever. Uh, drop me a comment and uh, if you want to buy me a beer, I don't want a beer to be honest with you, or a coffee, uh, please hit the super thanks button. Um, also read the video description. The information in the video description changes all the time. The newsletter's in there. You should get on the newsletter. Yeah, If you're one of them people that just lurk and think, what's he got to say? Sometimes the things are a bit too sensitive and I'm, you know, I might just put my little opinions in the newsletter. You know what I'm saying? It's free, it don't cost you anything. Yeah. No. no, we're not like that around here. We don't need to do that around here. Uh, what else we got? Well, we've got a chat room and my social media. Hey, just think if you read the video description and follow me on X, AKA Twitter and Instagram at Duncan Oldham, if you do that now, you will be able to watch my exciting journey today. Ooh, how fucking ghoul is that? Ghoul, did I say ghoul? Well, it's not too far from where I'm going, I suppose. Right, I'm off. <clears throat> I am looking forward to speaking to you all tomorrow afternoon, right? So please do try and come along. If you can't make the afternoon, come to the evening one. We're gonna do it at six tomorrow night, okay? All right, guys, take it easy. Have a great fucking day and don't let the bastards grind you down. <laughs>